Hiya, and welcome to another edition of File Wanderer. I'm up in Fleetwood at the moment. Uh, brought my dogs a walk and everything while I've gone to uh, have a, I don't know, bloody nails done or something like that. So I thought, well, I'll have a wander around here. Uh, we've got high tide at the moment. Uh, so I'm just going to have a wander onto the beach. Uh, this is that new building that's been, so well, the old, the old uh, radar station that was sold earlier on this year. Uh, the guy bought it and he's, he's done it all up and it's, uh, well, it's looking all right, it's looking nice. But it's a bit running to rack and ruin, isn't it? And then this is bottom lighthouse here, look. Uh, yeah, it's a bit of a, uh, bit of a breezy day today, but it's not cold. Uh, yeah, over here, that's Houston Hotel there. So, uh, it's built on a, like a crescent. North Houston Hotel. I'll have a wander around here. So it's a bit breezy, as I said, but it's not cold. So, uh, so I've brought dogs out for a little wander. Ambulance man, I've had a drink here, a cup of tea. They deserve a break, don't they, them lads and lasses? We'll just go on to the sands here, look. I don't know whether you can see it with this camera, I'll, I'll zoom in a bit. But uh, that's all Cumbria in that there, it, right, right in the horizon. Uh, it's ever so bright today. And then you've got uh, the Asian number two pa uh, nuclear power station there. Uh, and then looking round, we've got this Yorkshire Dales and everything. Uh, have a wander on here. Some stalwarts here having a, uh, a sit on beach. <laughs> oh, look at this. <coughs> That's the other side of that uh, radar station, look. It's a wacky shape, isn't it? But it's got, uh, I think it's grade two listing or something. It's something like that. Uh, and, uh, well, he's, he's done it up, he's done it, or doing it up lovely. So it will look well when it's finished. And other side at bottom lighthouse. And just up there, I don't know if you can see his uh, Pharaoh's lighthouse. Uh, Have a wander down to the sea. I love listening to the sea. It, uh, I don't know, it really helps me. Uh, sounds bloody wacky, don't it? But it's, I don't know, it sort of like soothes me a lot. Uh, just listening to it and watching it. I could sit and, well, I could stop here hours. So, dogs think I'm daft. <laughs> they don't really. So, yeah. Look at that. Tremendous, isn't it? Oh, then it's lifeboat in training there. That over there is not end. Yeah, I don't think you can see them, lads. They're, uh, they've been practicing on lifeboat. Well, it's like a dummy lifeboat type thing, practice boat. So, uh, and that up there, that's where the uh, Not End Ferry Crosses comes across. Uh, that's spectacular when, when that's running. Yeah. See, it's a right current on this 
estuary here and he has to do like a zigzag to get across when it's high tide. So, and back over to Houston and everything, look. And right in the distance, that's where the uh, old pier used to be. Uh, it got, I think it burnt down, I can't remember what year it was, 2009, something like that. So, uh, yeah. Ah, oh, that's little lifeboat there, look, that's just going out. Look at him, he's doing some dancing and bobbing about, isn't he? Bloody hell, I'm glad I'm not on that. Oh my God. Well, they can have that. Sounds lovely to see though, doesn't it? So I've not, uh, I've not been 100% this week. I've uh, fell a bit down in dumps. And it's, it's just nice to come and just you know, come for a wander with dogs and just see see what's going on in the world. Uh, I uh, I sent a a, 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 mag, a mag mount for a GoPro to a guy uh, that's on YouTube the other day, and he picked it up last night and he sent me a lovely message. But in fact, he's put, put me on one of his videos. Uh, if you want to check it out, it's. <laughs> I know it sounds a bit morbid, but it's just opposite. Uh, it's it's uh, Michael Fogg, uh, what is it, My Michael Fogg uh, Funeral Directors in Sheffield. They're independent funeral directors. And Mick uh, warns it, he does, well, he suffers a lot like me. He, he has, uh, you know, depression problems and everything. Uh, and he anxiety attacks and things like that. And if you want to check that out, it's, it's a really good site and it's far from what you think it's going to be. It's quite quite funny what it comes out with because he's, <laughs> he's got a farm up in North Yorkshire and he, he talks from there and he, he puts loads of videos on it, well he has done recently. Uh, but he gets like me, he's, he, he'll put a few on and then he stops for a bit. Uh, but he's really, he's really funny and really entertaining. And... Uh, I mean, sometimes his language can be a bit funny, but if you don't like swearing, don't watch it. But he's not too bad at all, you know. Uh, so, wait, well, he's not bad in the slightest. But what a lovely guy, him and his wife, Cheryl. Uh, so, yeah, just check him out and, and subscribe to him if you can. Cause, like me, he hasn't got that many viewers. Uh, and uh, he's, he's put a lovely message on for, for me. And I'd just like to return it back, you know. Uh, I mean, I sent him this out, this thing out, and I haven't even, I just put my name, you know, name at the website on and all that, and that's it. And he's, he's took time to thank me, but, you know, publicly. And I'd just like to re reciprocate with that. Uh, he's just such a nice guy. And I've not done it for any other reason than, I saw him the other day up, up on his farm, he was in his old tractor, his old Massey Ferguson tractor, and he nearly dropped his GoPro. And I got this uh, this magnetic mount, uh, and I thought, wait, I'm not using it. I've never used it. I bought it. And I've never used it. I mean, I've got two or three more, uh, and I uh, I just thought, wait, well, you know, somebody could make some use of that. And I thought, well, Michael looks like he could use it, so I sent it to him. That, and that's all it's about. It's not, you know, not about anything else. So it's just mates being mates, isn't it? Well, I don't know him, so. He's hardly a mate, but we've just met him, you know, watching his channel uh, on YouTube. So, yeah, give him a shout and, well, give, give him a look up and give him a subscribe if you will. So, right, we'll head back a little bit. Yeah, just come off at beach a bit now. And uh, just having a wander up here. So, uh, there's actually uh, not a ferry gone out. So we'll have a walk up there. This is giving you a bit of history on uh, Fleetwood. Uh, yeah. Peter Hesketh, he was the squire of Rossall. Yeah. Uh, it's interesting. It's, I think it's a lovely place, Fleetwood. Yeah, it's a lot of bad press, but I don't think it's bad at all. 
not to where we've come from. So, uh, yeah. There's all fish on the floor, look here. That, like a shoal of fish. So it's a big fishing heritage, Fleetwood, as you probably well know. This is Anita Lafford. One of her welcome home sculpture. Oh. Lovely, isn't it? So if you you don't have to be far out of Blackpool to see some lovely places. You really don't. It's uh, you know you can get out of hustle and bustle of things very easily. So. Yeah, I think it's high tide now actually. Uh, I don't know what this memorial is here. It's a fairly new one to me, this. Past this place, the fishermen of Fleet would have sailed for generations while their families watched from the shore. Their courage and comradeship under hardship is a living legend. This memorial, depicting equipment from a trawler, was placed here in recognition of the great contribution to which the men and women of the fishing community have made to the life of Fleetwood. And this is some names of the uh, people who were out fishing being killed or injured in ships. More can be beyond to the Arctic coast. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? It's December 1987. I don't know why I haven't seen that. There we go. Further on. I know we've got one up here that's uh, there were a helicopter went down uh, on this I think it was on this coast somewhere it weren't far away from here uh, ah can you see all fishing on footpath <laughs> yeah let's see look this was 2006 Yeah, took him Morecambe Bay. They got killed. 27th of December, bloody hell. They were off out, off out to uh, one at, uh, I don't know, the oil rigger and gas platform. Sad, isn't it? A gold pier. <laughs> this is uh, where they practice here, look, at uh, River Wire launching facility it is. So, yeah. The glimpse at North Houston there a lot. That's Pharaoh's lighthouse there. This is where tram comes to and buses and everything comes from Stargate and he'll obviously he's only off to Blackpool in a bit. Yeah. Or in the light shop here though. Yeah. 
This is part of old Fleetwood, that ferry thing there, crikey. We'll just have a wander up here and uh, see whether we can see the ferry coming in. Yeah, that's an old building there, isn't it? Where it says ferry on it. Oh, it's coming in, look. So I think it's a couple of quid to go across. Look at that. It's shaking him about right there, isn't it? My God. I keep saying I'm going to go on it one day. But I've not been yet. Look at that. Well, and he spins it there, look. Pretty impressive, isn't it? Look, wire estuary ferry. Wire rolls. Oh, and the ramp comes down to... Uh, let people get off. Not many on today. Well, there's only oh, there's only two on look. <laughs> right, this is Esketh Park we're going into. It's named in memorial to uh, Peter Esketh. Uh, there's a monument just up here for him. So big anchor there look, from fishing in the days. And it's have a look in Houston at all again look. It's like another world. There's tram there, look. They'll be going back to Blackpool in a short. Yeah. It's lovely up here, it's right. Uh, well, it's just lovely. They look after it well. So, it's nice at night when you come on here, or early evening. Because these lights light up. I've got, I've got a few stills of it, actually. And it does look well. Look at that there, that mussel shell. That's from the seagulls, that. They pick them up and come and drop them on here and smash shells to get uh, muscle out. <laughs> They're not daft, are they? Yeah, this is monument for Peter Esketh, just up here. My dog is just having a sniff, I just have to bear with me. There you go. I don't know you can read that. This is on my own land, on my own warren. On my warren, by the banks of the stream, out of this wasteland will rise up in glory. A shining new town, a town of my dreams. Bar Baxter. I wonder if that's them who did soup. <laughs> I wouldn't have thought so. He's all in a, uh, a model of... Uh, Bottom lighthouse, look. So, 
It's Sir Peter Esketh Fleetwood, 1801 to 1866. The only one at 67, bloody hell. Nearly my age. Cannon just here, look. Look at that. Wow. And we've got rest at Euston Hotel. It really is a lovely place. Yeah. That's another uh, angle from it, look. Yeah. If you, if you come into Blackpool, I urge you to come over here. Because there's some lovely places, lovely parks and things like that. Uh, I mean, there are in Blackpool, but you have to just walk a decent way. If you come in for a day or something like that, you know, you've, you've got to wander about. But over here, they're very uh, accessible. They're, uh, they're not bad at all. You know, so, uh, yeah, I urge you to come. It's lovely. I love it. So, I should have been here years ago. Right then, well, uh, I think I've about done for now. So uh, I'm going to love you and leave you. And uh, if you'd like to uh, subscribe, you know what to do. Press that, press that subscribe button. I love your comments. Uh, I said today I'm running about 60%. Uh, I've been a bit down in dumps. Uh, but you get days like that, don't you? So, uh, I'm not going to chuck myself off at bloody, uh, what's it, to beer at the moment. Yeah, I'm not that bad. But you just have good days and bad days, don't you? So, anyway, this is, I'm going to sign off now. And uh, give us a like, give us a share, and give us a comment. It's, I answer every one, or every one I see. Uh, sometimes I might not see them for weeks, and then I don't know where they bloody come from. So, uh, anyway... Thanks ever so much for watching, if you've got this far. And we'll see you up next one. So cheers, bye.